Shannon O'Connell, great victory. How do you feel? Yeah, I feel good. I feel like I could do it all again. Like, I wasn't really high-paced fight, so, I mean, I feel fresh still. Yeah. One thing I've realised about you is that, you know, in training you're sometimes off and you're saying, oh, I'm feeling off and that, but once you get the fight, no, you just turn it on. No, no, what? that's what? so not me. Once I get to fight and I'm like, shit, what, what if I forget, what if I get forget what to do like who throws the first punch like what if I fall over or or what if I forget how to box and then they play my music and I'm like get me out there, there we go. now very impressive you're sharp you're strong um and people call you old but you're still going you know maybe about 10 years younger than me but you're still throwing the punches hard and doing very well Ten? Seven. <laughs> <laughs> yeah look I feel I feel good you're only as old as you feel I feel yeah. great I feel better than I did 10 years ago so I, I'll people keep asking me when are you going to retire I'll retire when I have to no, Until then, one, I'm still here, I'm still going to be killing it. Yeah, one thing you can't beat is experience, and that's what it showed out there. I just knew that Taylor wasn't experienced enough to go. And with you, credit to her for going in there. Um, a bit of bad blood before the fight. Was it legit bad blood? or? It was very legit bad blood, more so from her coach. Um, but I believe that you know you are who you surround yourself with, and, and she surrounds herself with shit. Well, great work on the victory. I hope you get a world title shot next, and all the best in your next fight. Thank you so much.